A salvo of rockets has been fired from southern Lebanon towards Israel in the third consecutive day of violence along the Lebanese-Israeli border. A security source told Reuters news agency on Tuesday the bombardment was carried out by Palestinian factions. A second source said shelling was hitting the southern area from which the rockets were launched. The Israeli military said it was responding with artillery fire to the rocket launches from Lebanon. At least six Palestinian journalists have been killed in a matter of days. Amid Israel's ongoing shelling of the besieged Gaza Strip, media networks and press freedom monitors have said, journalist Said al Tawil, editor-in-chief of al Khamza news website, and two other members of the press were killed early on Tuesday as they went to film building that Israel would soon bomb in Gaza City. Unfortunately, they have sent a warning notice to the Hiji building just now that it will be bombed, al Tawil said in his last words, shortly before being killed, According to a recording obtained by Al Jazeera, the area has been evacuated entirely. Women, men, the elderly, kids have all completely fled the area. Al Tawil, Mohammed Sub, and Hisham Al Nwaha had been standing at a safe distance, hundreds of meters the stated target. But the air attack instead hit a different building, much closer to them. Al Nwaha suffered serious injuries and was admitted to the intensive care room at Al Shifa Medical Complex, the Palestinian news agency Wafa reported.